Hello again. Doc back with more of Mega Man 2 Special Weapons Run. We have defeated all the Robot Master bosses, so you know what's coming next. Well, okay. The password screen was not what I had in mind, but okay. Now let's get going. Ah yes, that infernal annoying sound. And those infernal annoying eyebrows. How does he do that? Seriously, I try to mimic that motion and there's no possible way I can get that. Huh. If he was as good at uh, making robots as he was good as eyebrows, we wouldn't have a chance. Alright. Oh, well. I can't use that weapon, what am I doing? Quick boomerang! Ah, the birds are going to decide to be a little bit of a pain for a while, but, um, this is kind of their last gas, because I don't think they appear anywhere else. Go ahead, birds, try to get your revenge on me. All you've done is hit me a couple times. Ow. Yeah, I probably shouldn't tempt fate. And item three actually has some use. Alright. This is a perfect place for Metal Blade, because they are really good against these things. Yeah, yeah those you don't want to waste time with, because they can kind of deal a lot of hits pretty quickly if you are not careful. That'll be a good time to restore this. Weapons energy is a little bit better than it was in previous games, I will say that. Um, you get a little bit more of it than you did than, like, say, the original Mega Man. That doesn't stop me from wasting it, though. Gathering a little bit of special, extra special uh, weapons energy here, just because this is kind of the last good point there is to grind with special weapons. And stage two, there's a place where you can get some good grinding with uh, the Buster, but um, using special weapons energy, it, those moles take, just take a little bit too much, uh, too many hits to take care of very quickly. And it's, you end up being more likely to waste your energy than gain it back. At any rate, I just want to fill up item 3. So now I'm going to have one more place where I need it later. And here's a point where Air Shooter can be actually quite a little bit useful. Yep, that angle makes it kind of nice. Unfortunately, we can do the same thing with Metal Blade, and a little bit quicker as well. I want to think, I gotta be really careful with my special weapons energy in this one. Mega Man 2 was kind of unforgiving in some weapons, uh, in some aspects of its, uh, special weapons. You need to use it all you need to use all your special weapons against uh, energy for some bosses. Some bosses that I really don't look forward to. And restoration can be kinda of difficult. So I'm gonna be trying to watch myself as best as possible here. this screen, you'll definitely need item 1. It's possible to uh, place them... It's possible to stand on top of the ladder and place them far enough away that you can get to the next screen, but that's a little bit dangerous. Going from near the bottom of the ladder is usually a better idea. Okay, this is the dangerous part. Um, I have a nasty habit of not doing too well on this platforming section here. So, 
to give it my best shot, but... Uh, whoa! <laughs> yeah, that was an example. Uh, okay. So, next goal is to get back there. At times, the angular uh, nature of the uh, uh, quick boomerang can really come in handy. I've mentioned that at times it can be a little bit frustrating, but you know, there's also the fact that, uh, well, sometimes it doesn't come in handy. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes you need a different weapon. I haven't shown off atomic fire, but I'm a little bit wary about wasting too much of that. Because uh, if atomic fire is one of those weapons that uh, sorry, one of those weapons that. Uh, Takes a heck of a lot of energy to use it in its proper way. Yeah, it's more like it. The thing is, if I run out of, if I lose another life, I may have to farm a bit for uh, energy for item two or item one. I'm not looking forward to that. I definitely don't want a game over because that I lose my E tanks. And I might need those. Alright. Oh shoot! Oh Mega Man disappeared. I had no idea where I was. Mega Man 2 had a uh, had a mechanic in place where if you had a special weapon that took less than one unit of energy, um, and then you used uh, some uses without using up a unit of energy, and then switched to a different weapon and switched back, you'd get back basically that full unit of energy. So if you use like three metal blades, switch weapons, and then still using metal blade again, you, choose, you get to use three more metal blades without using a bar of energy. That is a uh, that's a nice way to conserve ammo if uh, you start running low. It doesn't work for any weapon that takes one or more units of energy to use though. So weapons like leaf shield, air shooter, crash bomb, you can't take advantage of it with those. Which is a shame, because I really wish I could take advantage of it with the Crash Bomb. Really, really wish. Take three! Hopefully Mega Man won't disappear on me. Because this is hard enough to do as is. Oh, he's flashy for sure, but uh, I can see him. Ah. Okay. Just stay up on this one. Stay up on this one, you will not die. Just keep using your quick boomerang. It only does one damage per hit, but it takes care of him very quickly. He doesn't have any invincibility frames. Always stand on that top block. You will never die. Unless you get hit by too many fireballs, but if you're firing properly, you will never die if you're standing on that top block. He will knock you back into the pit if you're standing anywhere else. Alright. Recharge for item 1 just in case. Not, I know I will need it uh, a couple of points later. Not too much of it, but enough that I want to be careful. Switch over to my metal blade again. Prop Tops hate Metal Blade. They are so easily dispatched by it, it's kind of funny. Uh, recharge that. Switch to item 2 very quickly. Okay, this is a tricky one. 
I want to get that second ladder. Yeah, got it. Whew. I do not always get that. And if you uh, fail on that one, it is a long, uh, it's a long ride back to. Uh, it's a long ride back to the beginning, and you're gonna have to farm for item two. Fortunately, you got Metal Blade to help you with that, but. Uh, I'm hoping I can avoid a couple of those. Yes! That's good. That's good. That's what I wanted to do. I don't have to defeat these guys, but it's just to kind of get them, uh, get them clear so I don't take a lot of extra damage. Here's why I wanted to save a couple of those. I do not need item 2 again. I know that for a fact. And yeah, I can. I am full on E-Tanks, so I'll just use one. Alright. So I can restore Crash Bomb a little bit. And not have to worry about uh, farming for as much energy for it. Whee! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Have fun, but be careful! I can't use that. Okay. Now here we have the hallway with the moles. Whoa! Uh, I wonder if there's anything that works especially well against them. Well. That works better than I thought it did. Wow, if you need to farm, this is the way to do it, I think. That's as good as I've seen any other weapon perform. I'm not too worried about using up my leaf shield. I'm not going to be using it against Airman anyway. Quick Boomerang is faster and more effective in my book. Ah, that was poorly done. Okay. Back to Metal Blade. I know I'll need that. This is a tricky section. I would use Flash Stopper. I don't want to waste my Flash Stopper. Wait, no, that's Time Stopper. Flash Stopper is Mega Man 4. Uh, the thing that gets me, it's always the same thing. It's that it's not his. It's, it's not aligned with his name. Usually, the uh, weapons have the bosses name in them somewhere, so... <laughs> I mean, it's not a rule that they have to, but usually they do. Alright. You just gotta... You gotta abuse angular firing and just be careful. And you won't have to use any health restoration against this guy at all. <laughs> well, I made that... I made that harder than it was supposed to be. Um... Yeah, but he's down. Didn't have to use an E-Tank, and didn't waste a life. So, on to the next stage. But I will make a quick video break here for, uh... Just to keep this from getting too long. A dramatic music! Ooh! Anyway... This is Doc. I will see you later.